Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be installing this radiator that I've got mocked up at the moment. I'm about to do some welding on it. I've just cut off the brackets as you can see on top here. There's one here, one here. And I'm going to reuse them and just mount them lower as this is a different radiator than the factory one. But hopefully today I'll be able to get this sorted and get this in and plumbed up. And we might be able to fire it sometime today. I've got most of the loom in to where it needs to be. I just need to needing it up and hide it a bit better. I've wired in the winch now. So that's hooked up onto the dashboard here with the switch, as you can see. And also the lights are wired up. So I'll show you those a bit later on. Righto guys, so I've been busy for the most part. I've got the uh, radiator in where I wanted it mounted anyway. And we've got the reservoir just mounted temporarily. Got water in it running to the motor, bit of fuel in the tank, I need a lid for the tank. Got the new carby in, air filter. Not only that, I have the lights hooked up to the dash. So they're just here now. Headlights and light bar. So now I'm going to see if I can get it running again today. I had it going the other day. I just, I'm going to disconnect the throttle because I need to make up a new tab as I run out of adjustment. For the foot pedal anyway. So, that may be a little bit loud if it does want to start, as I don't have a muffler on it, but yeah, I'll try to start it up and get this thing running for you guys. <laughs> Basically now, what I want to do is I'm going to see if I can change the gear to select by hand. Let's see if we get any movement in the rear end.
So the loom's all in now. I've hooked up the wiring lights. I've got the winch connected. I've had to wire that into the dash. Now that's on a switch. I just got to needing up some of the wiring behind the dash. Got that mounted. Got the horn in there. Ignition, lights, winch in and out. So the winch is in and out on dash, so it makes it a lot easier, less hassle. I've got to work on getting the gear shifter in and the cable mounted for it. But for the meantime, I'm quite happy with how it's coming so far. 